We all know it is very important for your website to look visually amazing. But it is also important to make your website highly functional as well, so your visitors can find the content they're looking for effortlessly. And you can make your website more functional very easily if you have the right tools. I mean, just look at this blog about movies. There is no doubt that this looks visually amazing and the visitors are gonna love it as well. But what makes it even better is its functionality features. Like, look at this grid. It has its own filter so your visitors can find the content they are looking for effortlessly. See how neat it is and how fast it works. And you can have it in your WordPress website also very easily using PostX. Let me show you how. All you have to do is select the grid that you want to add the filter to. You can see for this particular grid, I've already enabled it and it's right over here. So let's select another grid. Let's just say this one. Select the grid and under the general tab, enable advanced filter. And there is our advanced filter. You can customize it as much as you like. You can change the alignment, change the gap. I'm going to keep it in center, change the spacing, tweak the spacing. Then you can add more filters if you want. You can add an author filter, filter by order, sort filter, custom taxonomy, and search filter, and so on. But that's not it. You can customize individual filter as well. Click on the filter that you want to customize. Then click on the settings icon and you can change the alignment from here as well. You can turn it into an inline style. You can even change the text of the all content text. Well, let's just keep it all text with this one. Then there is a visual customization setting. To do so, click on this icon right over here. From here, you can change the typography. You can select the uh, style. Let's just keep that post X global style because that suits really well. You can change the size. You can even change the font, the weight, and so on. Then there's a color. You can change the color of the text. Let's keep it at black. Change the hover color. That looks nice. But I'm going to change the hover background color to white. So, yeah. You can change the normal background color as well. Then there's a setting for border, border radius, box shadow, padding, and so on. You can even customize the drop down style. You can change the alignment. This looks better right now. And the typography option. You can even change the color of the drop down menu which sits apart from the actual text of the filter then there's a the hover color you can change nope i'm gonna change it to black yeah that looks much better but this is not the way it's gonna look this i'm just showing you the possibilities and there is similar to the previous settings there is a border setting the border radius and so on and that's how easily you can enable wordpress post filter into your website that's it for this video thank you for watching if you have any more questions or suggestions feel free to drop them in the comment section below don't forget to like and subscribe man i love these filters